Hey everybody, how's it going? I uh, got a couple packages in and some pickups from the past few months. Um, no, past month or so. Uh, some of them. Uh, let's see here. I'll start off with this, and then I'll get to the packages. Uh, I'm probably going to be the one that digs this, but uh, Ron Kittle, PSA, rookie card, autographed. I'm trying to get a. Since he doesn't have many certified autographs, I get the certified. I'm trying to get a bunch of his cards in certified form, so. There's a bunch of them uncertified that I don't want, but the uh, those I'll definitely go after if they're cheap. Um, next, I was waiting for this package to come in before I did the video, but uh, Panini Points cards came in today. I had 500, and so I picked out a couple cards, and shockingly, they have a lot of nice stuff on there. I mean, I don't like the whole points thing. I'd rather get my hits, but at least they gave me an option, and one of the hits was actually better than anything in my box, so... Go figure. But uh, first one, uh, number two of 25, George Springer. And uh, it does suck they charge you. They charge me 444 to ship these to me. But uh, and actually, the the cards they show on there isn't the actual card they send because the card I that's a way better autograph than the one I picked out. So I was happy with that. And then this one, like I said, is better in my box. That's, yeah, that. Springer's 2 of 25, I can't remember if I said that. But numbered uh, 51 of 75, and this card is just gorgeous. And I didn't have one of him, Jarvis Landry. I know the selects are cheap, but man, they're gorgeous cards. I don't know how anybody, any card collector can't like those. Sticker auto or not, gorgeous cards. So there's a the numbering. So, a couple nice cards for Panini points, can't go wrong there. Um, Next up, got the UFC tonight, so I uh, decided to show these, pick this up on the cheap, uh, nice Dan Henderson, uh, these champions go super cheap for some reason, I really like this design actually, it's basic but I like that design this year, actually I'd like it better than Knockout, I think Knockout really dropped the ball this year, but nice Hendo autograph, which... and then uh, I picked a couple of this guy up because I seen him fight the last time and you know Benson's Benson Henderson may be retiring when he's 33 next year so I need someone to root for and I really like this guy he impressed me a lot in the last few fights so um, I instantly got on eBay and picked up a couple of them and I haven't seen any cards of his listed since so I'm kind of glad I got him when I did but uh, out of what year is this 2012 finest finest moments Tony Ferguson, El Kakui. That guy is just fun to watch. Great fighter. So, definitely be picking up more of his stuff. I like him a lot. And I just wish uh, Benson would stick around more. I'll stick like Benson stuff, but of course. And then numbered uh, 123 out of 150. Uh, da, 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 da. God, what? Yeah, the 2012 UFC knockout. Tony Ferguson on Cardano. Now he has one other that has his nickname on there, but they want like 40 bucks for it. These were like super cheap, like under 10 bucks. So glad I got him when I did, because now I can't find any. So uh, if anybody out there has any Tony Ferguson, let me know. Let's see if we can work out a deal. I'd be interested. Um, next up, uh, trade with uh, Fight on Five Two James. Uh, I got this package a few days ago. Um, it was a trade, so I wasn't expecting anything extra. And let's see, uh, sent me Prism, Barry Sanders. And then this was a pretty big card, man. I can't. Uh, you didn't have to send this, James. This, uh, the Red Sox top prospect just paid him thirty million dollars. Yohan Makata. Tenders Auto, which is freaking awesome. I really like that. I was actually looking at his stuff too, trying to get one before maybe he goes off. So, thank you very much, James. You did not have to do that. It was way more than I sent you. And like I said, you didn't have to send anything. So, I appreciate it very much. That card is awesome. He has a really nice auto autograph too. That's pretty cool. So, 
Hope he's worth the 30 mil. <laughs> and then the card we traded for, uh, he wanted my uh, jumbo for the set, so I traded him for this one, which is very cool, the Michael Phillips. This one now you rated the Tylus patches from the absolute bullshit. And I did not have one, so I'm still sitting on all of mine except the one I sent James and the one I sent Michael because no one's had any trade offers or want their cards or whatever. So that's the only trade I've been able to make. Um, so it is what it is. Uh, let's see, last one. This came today unexpectedly. Nick, Yankee Fan 95. Uh, so we'll get into this. Uh, it says, Chris, here are a few cards for your PC that we've talked about. Enjoy, PS, don't send anything back. <laughs> well, I'm sorry, but if I get any Yankee stuff, I'm chance starts going to you. You're my Yankees guy, so as I've told you. Uh, first up, oh, that's the Jackie he was talking about. Very cool. Jackie Robinson for the Jackie Robinson PC. That thing is gorgeous. I'm taking that out of penny sleeve. I think that's awesome in person. My cat's walking all over cards. Because James is an asshole. And so, that is freaking cool. Really good picture. Try a different camera angle, so I'm not getting the lighting I normally get. And oh, wow. Dude. Uh, yeah, he told me about these. How, how ironic I start the video off like that. The wrong kittle. Uh, from TriStar Signa Cuts, the wrong kittle with the, the glitter on there. That is awesome. Number 3550. There's a number there. That was a really nice autograph of this, too. And then from TriStar again, number 21 of 29. Big old cutout 8x10 auto Ron Kittle. So I see these all the time and I never pull the trigger on them. So. Appreciate it, Nick. Always looking out. Love me some Ron Kittle. I just tweeted the guy the picture of the card Phil sent me, so maybe I'll have to send him another tweet of those so he can like it and not say anything again. But uh, thank you, James and Nick and eBay people. Um, I guess that's it. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Um, the case is kind of new today. Let's see if I can get all that in there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> If anybody cared. Uh, that is it. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks. See ya.